everyone, what's going on? After all, exam is over, right? Look, never be afraid of exams. Why? If we read just a little bit like time, we can see that all our reading will be complete long before the exam. Whatever, a new class and I'm your Aridam sir here to discuss something new today. Our today's topic is system tray. But before coming into this point, just take a quick look in our reality. I hope we all know about this tray. Just like the image you can see on your screen. Now the question is what we can do with this? With this tray? We can hold anything on it. And not only that. What we do not need, we can take it away from the tray. So the concept of tray on computer is almost same. What it is? The system tray is another name given to the notification area. And where it is located? We can find in the right side of the windows taskbar. And system tray feature different type of notification and alerts from your computer like your internet connection. or the volume level etc. So it is almost same like our real tray it can hold all of those tasks all of those applications what is open or if there is any notification we can see these within this system tray or system trick and so was those notification suppose if any application need update you can see in, on your mobile screen also there are several apps installed in your mobile phone and the same things for computer also here are also apps there's been application software what we are using for various purpose if it is require any update if it is require any other task supposed to clean some memory or any other thing so that notification can come through the system tray and this is the overview of the system tray just look at this and this is windows 7 based taskbar where we can see the system tray what you can see here from the left a small arrow if we click on it we can see all the hidden system tree icons I told you if any notification comes then we can see this through the system tree then our network if we are connected with internet then we can see this if we are not connected that also we can see next our volume level that's been sound how much it is we can increase or decrease I mean volume up and down we can do with this after that so desktop just at the right hand side if you want to click on it then we can directly go to the desktop so this is a basic overview of our system tray on our next class we'll discuss more and, and we will see these all step by step practically
so no more today see you soon till then take care stay home and stay safe